So me and Morgan's story actually starts a lot sooner than most think. Me and Morgan first started following each other almost around three and a half years ago now. But nothing really happened with our relationship, that is, until January of this year. In January this year, me, Morgan, and a few others went to a house in LA. And that is where I found myself falling in love with Morgan. I don't know what it is, but I just couldn't keep my eyes off her. After that, I flew out to California to spend a week with her to see how we liked each other. And this video is from then. This a... You have to look at me. Well, what do you... After that video, we spent lots of time together, went to expos together, and I just knew this was the girl of my dreams. I knew that this was the person I was supposed to be with, and Morgan has everything that I want in life in a partner. And so, with all that being said, we lead up to this very special moment. I feel very grateful for uh, for my family. Uh, that's my brothers and sisters, and my and, uh, and, and my kids, and then um, all the people that I feel really um, uh, close to. Uh, uh, Danny, I think I would call you one of my kids, uh, even though I really don't want to. <laughs> 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 he got you in spite of himself. <laughs> I'm just that lovable. I always, I always make sure that Danny, Danny doesn't really figure out that I really love him. I like, I like keeping him on his toes where he's really confused, not too sure whether I love him or hate him. <laughs> but I. I, I can remember days when Danny's not here and people are talking about uh, kids. And, uh, people are talking about kids and uh, and and fostering. And every time I have to defend you, I get emotional. You brought a wonderful family to Canada. And I've met some pretty darn nice people here today, and, and I appreciate that. And that, Danny, I want to thank you for that. You finally got something right. <laughs> Man, these guys love giving you a <laughs> One thing that I am grateful for is a lot of you probably don't really, except, well, Diane and Richard know, but a lot of you don't really know what Danny went through when he was young. He went through hell, and look how he's turned out. And he never strayed off the path. When he tried to go to school here, and the kids picked on him so bad, they had to take him out of the school here. But he never let that put him down. He still held his head up. And I'm very proud of that pot liquor for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I do hope there's going to be a wedding. And I hope there's going to be a wedding. Oh, man. <laughs> I hope you don't wait. Is that I, pressure, Larry? I hope you don't Is wait. Is that the sound I, of pressure? I die. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you don't wait till I die because you know that newlyweds and nearly deads, you gotta keep that in the back of the <laughs> But anyway, Danny and I we met some grand people here tonight, mm -hmm. and boy, I'll yes. tell you, I'm more than happy. It just wouldn't be for him, this wouldn't have happened. 
<laughs> now it takes two to keep it going. <laughs> and uh, I'm wishing you all the best, and I hope you do it before I can't be there. <laughs> you better hang in there. <laughs> Man, right before my turn. <laughs> I'm realizing I'm grateful because Daddy's taking the pressure. <laughs> <laughs> I am very thankful for the fact that the man that I fell in love with has such an awesome family and that I've been so welcomed here by all of you guys because <laughs> it's been a big change to be in a different country but I felt so welcomed and loved here so especially today I truly appreciate you guys welcoming me into your home. Okay, I guess that. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. <laughs> Of course, I'm thankful for friends and family as well. I don't know if I would be the man today that I am without my grandparents supporting me through everything. Um, Rich and Diane for taking me in when they did. It's just, yeah, the people in this room are, you know, like I get obviously a lot of credit for going through stuff and getting through it, but I would not have been able to get through that stuff at all without a lot of the people in this room. And then lastly, of course, I'm thankful for my beautiful, amazing, your friend Morgan, you're the most supportive person I know. You love me, you care for me. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think you were right when God said that we were made for each other. Aww. So Morgan, was it Bradley? Are you married? Stop like talking about your nails because I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, you just refused to get your nails done. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> How did you keep that a secret? Oh my god. 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 Oh my god.
any other time you feel like, sure, can I get a pedicure too? <laughs> Oh my gosh, wait, did you really not have any idea? I had